Welcome to Basic Beck Beauty. I'm doing a special pop-up video just for Halloween. I thought if people are going out and they want something that's quick and easy, pretty simple, let's uh, start with that. I thought I'd do a red black look and a red black lip and eye. I'm using the uh, Conspiracy palette by Shane Dawson. Uh, anyway, never mind. I'm not going into the, the backlash of this, so just going to start with, uh, we might start with the, the red, which is called Flaming Hood, and that's going to be our base, so we're just going to put it down. What are your plans for Halloween? Are you doing anything? Are you going out? Are you staying home? Are you having a party? Do you like Halloween? Do you celebrate Halloween? Let me know in the comments below. I love hearing from you all. I want to thank you all for um, subscribing, watching and liking the videos. It helps me out a lot. So if you've got a hooded eye, see how I look up? It sort of disappears. Bring it up. Bring it up. Because um, I used to put everything on my lid, but then when you open your eye, it's all gone. Bring it underneath. I'm staying home and I'm watching horror movies. Might have some pizza and horror movies. I love Halloween. But um, yeah, I just didn't have anything planned. I've had a really, really, really busy week. So everything has just changed and, and it's car trips and Mum do this and do that and pick me up and drop me there and this has changed and I need this and I need that and you know, that's what you do. So, okay, now I'm using a different brush, a smaller brush, could have used a bigger brush for that. Actually I might get, I might blend, I'll do it later. I like to do everything backwards. So I'm going in with, what's this called? A black, or my right tin. I probably shouldn't be using this one either. Anyway, don't blame your tools. That's what you do with them. So I'm just gonna put that down there. And there's a lot of fallout, don't worry about that. That, that, that. It may look a lot, but when I open my eyes, because my hood doesn't really look that extreme. I did this the opposite a couple of years ago. I did um, red lid and a black, um, not the top. So we're just going to Keep layering that up, it doesn't matter how it looks. We'll blend that later. And you can add as much as you want. And then when it falls down the bottom like that, you can do your foundation, like wipe it away. See, look, just get a brush, brush it away, and then um, go in with your foundation afterwards on top of it, or just get makeup remover afterwards and then remove it that way. Okay, underneath. 
this again. And if you want, you can just leave that there and blend it down there and make you look like a haggard out zombie or something. What a donkey. Um, now we're going to blendy blendy. Blend it out so it match. Uh, so it's, oh my God, I can't think of words. So it blends, whatever, it mixes. And it doesn't look as um, severe. Some under there, and we'll blend it. Oh, do I have a little? Yeah, a little brush. Blendy, blendy. Remember, there's no right and wrong. If you don't like it, just take it off and do it again. Oh, I forgot to put the yes, the red. I forgot. Why didn't you tell me I forgot to do the other eye? Oh my goodness. enough red uh, oh fine I have to get some more go under with the red now we're going under with the little black uh, what was I blending with I think it was the white one I can't remember Now, quick and easy. You, you can go in it as long as you want. You know, you can do fine detail and brush it up. And now we're just going to go straight in the lips. Doesn't have to be red, it could be any colour, doesn't have to match. I'm just doing what I did a couple of years ago, and I thought I'll redo it. So this is uh, metallic, which makes it looks shimmery. It's got a bit of glitter flex in it, and it should dry and not wear off. Should, as long as you let it dry, not like I did before. Now we get a black pencil. Get blind at time. Which 
coloring in the corners. and blend them as much as you can but this pencil's not really working for me today. Did I get that other one? I didn't get the other one, of course I didn't. This pencil is failing me big time. <laughs> oh my God. All right, let me go back in with small gloss and see what this does. You can always go in on top with a, um, a clear or a natural red colored lip gloss and then blend it. Just gonna too bad from what I can see. Okay. So that's that. Uh, if you want, you can get either a dark brown, wouldn't do a black, I'd probably do a dark brown. I'm going to go in with the, uh, what am I going with, the, the spiralling up in the, up in the corner there. So dark brown. I'm getting a blusher and I'm just going to contoury blushy sort of without doing the whole full on contour. So I'm just going to curve it around a bit. So it looks like you're a little bit dead. If it's too dark, you can always light it up and put some blush there. So. I will do a video later on about contouring and blush and highlighting and all the rest of it. Just haven't got to it yet. And then I'll do a full look from start to finish using the whole thing. But since I've only just started, I just wanted to work on one thing at a time and um, yeah, and just do a quick Halloween look. And then next week is Melbourne Cup Day and I hope to do a look for that on Tuesday. So I've gone from grrr to ooh la -de -da. So, oh, I've got my Chucky and my Chucky necklace. Some knife earrings. My little skeleton heads. So.
So here we go. We go in with the uh, pencil again. That'll give us some definition. If it works. I like these lips. So, um, hopefully it works better for you. It's this, uh, this pencil liner really did me wrong. It didn't blend, it was too glunky. I think this will be it and it might get chucked out. It does, it's just... Ugh. Ah, uh, well, that's what I have grabbed and, and you work with what you got. Some people be lucky to have this pencil. Uh, so I've gone in the waterline, which is the, uh, the bit just where your eyelashes are. The waterline, red on there with dark pencil. You can even do red on there. And I'm using my little... <clears throat> Excuse me, using my little scar. Isn't it so cute? Look at that. It's a little skull. What? For how awesome is that? I got this off Wish. So I don't know what it's called. I don't know if it's anything. I don't know if you can see what it's called or not. Oh my god. It's called Max Volume Scar. I don't know why I did that voice. Don't mind me. It's been a long week. All I need now is my mascara to fail me. Beautiful. I will do future videos of eyelashes and how to apply them and eyebrows and different, like I want to do the whole kit and caboodle. And if there's anything that you want to focus on, you can write that in the comments as well. Okay, I think that's it, we'll leave it at that. So this is a basic, basic back Halloween look. Do what we with you will. I hope it works out better than you. With you, than my lips, my lips look a little bit. Mm. Mm. Thanks a lot. Uh, happy Halloween.